Antonius recommended to me Monolith of Doubt live at Cops Pigaqua Cops Pichaka 2002 21 year old floor Ho 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 Let us how old is she now in her thirties or forties or fifties you tell me to you I had no disrespect to me I would guess she's late thirties maybe early who knows but this is uh, going to be very interesting this was 2002 if she was 21 then that was um, 17 years ago so she is 38 almost 40 floor how do you feel what do you wish to accomplish by your 40th birthday what about your 50th um, are you proud of everything you have discovered everything you have achieved do you feel you have achieved or do you feel you are a vessel of nothing do you feel that you have not given your best work to the universe do you feel that you are not where you wanted to be at 40 almost 40 your fans can speak for you I'm sure what gifts you bring to the table what juicy chicken we feast upon for your performance I wonder if this was her first band ever or if it was her third or fourth or fifth how many bands has Flo been in do inform you and all who may read the comments hmm. going to be exciting 3, 2, 1 go I did that completely wrong just so you know I'll go back 3, 2, 1 go I think that was also wrong but this is a crazy channel the crazy people okay first of all <laughs> that is a uh, quite unusual sound it sounded like someone banging a car door and then we get these uh, uh, the violins but these string instruments did not expect to see those here it's quite quite grungy behavior which is quite uh, refreshing I say that a lot these days but it's uh, different to what we what we know I think from floor but also it fits with her with her place in Nightwish because Nightwish do different sounds and different they surprise you and this was surprising too convenient it sounds so almost messy She does not look much different, does she? She really does not. This isn't the type of voice I what I I thought I would hear from her. I thought I would hear the more, the the more sort of power voice, the uh, the sort of uh, gritty or not really gritty. But if she was a man, it would be gritty. But the uh, the powerhouse vocals, I thought she would come out with but here it seems uh, she's uh, starting off with the uh, the sort of ye ethereal is that the word sort of angelic type of voice which was nice now we're getting into it a bit the rock sort of voice Sounds like they're hitting glasses. It's a, uh, it's a, uh, it's quite a uh, fascinating sound. It's quite a, uh, quite a, uh, what's the word? I don't know the word. Rustic. 
I think is the word. Rustic sound. Like you're just banging on things that you find in your kitchen or your wardrobe. Not all of it, but there's elements of it. I like her belt! <laughs> she has a style of uh, moving which I haven't seen from her before. I wonder if she still had the signature windmill uh, that she does with, with her head uh, about to fly off. Uh, propel as a weapon for your enemy. I wonder when she uh, first did that, I will assume it was with Nightwish, but maybe, just maybe, we might see an appearance here too. The Origin! Very pretty music and a very pretty collaboration with her voice and those strings. Is anyone from this band? Did they go on to Nightwish too? Or is it a completely different members here? Because it, it does actually feel quite uh, similar in terms of slowing down a tempo and going back up and bringing that hard beat back. It's uh, quite similar, but then I suppose she, that's what she, uh, the music she was attracted to. And sucked her into the crimes! Like the medieval sound is coming in now. She likes to shake her hair, but we didn't get it. This might be the origin of the century. Castro Petra. Bravo. Bravo to you. That was Floor as a 21 year old with the band After Forever. I'm assuming that's the name of the band and not the song. That was on the channel Metal Wish. I'm assuming that band then doesn't have its own YouTube channel. Maybe it does, but I suspect not. Hmm. Well, she had the confidence from the beginning, but she seemed a bit more, uh, well, youthful, I guess. A bit more, um, relaxed, maybe. Uh, a bit more bouncy, a bit more, um, 
I suppose, in no, improvisational, I guess, with her movement. I, maybe I just have an extremely terrible memory, and that has been proven time and time again. But she, I, she always does the windmill in with Nightwish. But I don't really recall her boogieing like she like she did in this video much. Um, so it was interesting to see a, a little more, um, I suppose, upbeat movement, a bit more um, intuitive, perhaps. Um, maybe, maybe it's just uh, just an age thing. I do see some some optimism, some great, great, great fun. You, you can see, you can see how much potential. I'm sure by this time she was already very experienced in performing. I'm sure this wasn't her first performance ever, even if it was her first televised. Uh, I'm not sure it was, but her first recorded. Um, I'm sure she, by this point, she had many years of practice because she seemed very confident she was a lot of smiles and a terrific voice still back then has it improved has it has it uh, declined uh, someone with greater greater passion than i would be able to inform you but uh, i know that i've watched her most recent performance with best day zanga uh, with Hank Port, they did the Phantom of the Opera, and her voice is in tip-top condition. Really, really uh, floor more. Really great voice to this day. And was it that different? I'm not sure. There, there was something different about it. But, you know, 19 years, 17 years difference it's still pristine and it's still extraordinary for sure that much can be admired that much can be proclaimed do uh, inform me if you find any other 21 year olds who can sing as Floor did just right here right now tell me your thoughts show me your crimes and remember, chomp on that subscribe button if you would like to eat the cheese. Farewell, my munchins. Take care. My munchins! <laughs> <laughs>